welcome again uh, dear friends uh, we are basically learning uh, to solve uh, equilibrium problems to understand the basic techniques how to solve problems uh, related to conditions of equilibrium so here is another problem where you are asked to apply equilibrium problems now look at a uniform point AB of length 4 meter. AB is total length from this point to this point is basically 4 meter. Now, and the weight is 500 meter. The total weight is 500 meter. Suspended is suspended by a vertical rope at one end. 500 newton at one end. And the other weight of 300 newton is standing at the distance of 1.2 meter. So here it is. She is standing at a distance of 1.2 meter. At one end A. By taking the moment about A, you have to take the moment about A. This one. Calculate the tension in the rope. Sporting and B. This one. Tension in the rope sporting area B. So, would you expect the tension in the rope A to be larger or smaller than that in rope B? Say the reason for your answer. You have to find the reason as well. First of all, you have to see what the value is given. Weight of the tank, tank is given. Weight of the gun is given. So, here a B is equal to 4 meter the whole length and this A C from this point to this point and this C is basically center and here it will be 2 centimeter here and 2 sorry 2 meter here and 2 meter here, to the other side so A D where is A and B these are a girl is standing at point 1.2 the point where the girl is standing. So tension in the row B, that is CB is equal to two. This one, tension in the B, that is C2. You are asked to calculate the tension on this point. So compare comparison of C and CB, you have to compare between the two. First of all, we will apply second condition of equilibrium. What it says, because you are asked to calculate B, so it means rest of the all torques are acting to the other side. This one, this one, and this one, and A. So it is T, uh, Ta, Ta1, and Ta A. So all the other torques are acting to the other side. So this torque is calculated by using A and B. The distance of this point, torque from moment on that is AB multiplied by T2. So you have taken one side, torque at B. So the rest of the torque, that is A, C, this one, A and C, multiply by W, this one, wait, and then A, D, this one, multiply by the weight of the girl, that is W1, and third one is acting at this point, A, at tension, due to tension T1. Because here it is, moment on zero, so that's why this should become zero at the end, but you have to follow the same sequence. So if you look at this is four meter, and this is the total values putting up in this formula here, it become it will become zero due to uh, zero of this a position moment arm, and it will be thirteen sixty. So you are calculating T two that is three forty. Yes, it is three forty tension action. According to first condition of equilibrium, we have T one. Plus T2 that must be equal to the uh, this one that is W multiplied by W2 plus W2 that is this one. Look at this one and it is T1 that is equal to W plus W1. This was plus addition of the weight. First of all, the weight is acting in downward direction, the tension in it is acting in upward direction. So, applying these two, you are getting uh, T1. And this shows that T1 is 460 degrees, sorry, 460 Newton 
which clearly shows that the T2, T1 is greater than the T2. So by this, you, you can calculate by using the conditions of equilibrium where the tension will be more and where it will be less by putting the values in these two. So during next class, we will again apply second condition of equilibrium to solve some more problems to understand the problem.